For NJ Advance Media, I'm Connor Hughes. On Tuesday, the New York Jets made the widely anticipated decision to release cornerback Darrell Rivas. Uh, the move frees $9.33 million in salary cap space and improves the Jets' overall salary cap availability positioning to about 20th most in the NFL. Uh, obviously, the salary cap space isn't entirely determined yet. But anyway, what should you make of, of this decision? What should you make of, of Darrell Rivas leaving the Jets for likely the final time in his NFL career? Well, you should have already thought about all this because this is a move that so many saw coming. Look, the, the Jets aren't releasing Darrell Rivas because of what happened in Pittsburgh. The Jets aren't releasing Darrell Rivas because they don't like him. They aren't releasing Darrell Rivas because he causes issues in the locker room. From a leading point of view, from a, a personality point of view, Rivas checks all the boxes. Simply put, he's just not the player that he used to be, and he's not worthy of the salary that he was going to get paid if he was on the Jets roster. See, Rivas was set to count $15.33 million against the salary cap space. If he was still a top flight corner and one of the best in the NFL, you can make the argument to keep, keep him on the roster for that salary. But he's not. I mean, Rivas at this point in his career is probably a number two, number three cornerback at best, that's not worth 15.33 million. So the Jets had to move on from him. You know, you can make the argument that, oh, well, he can convert to safety and he can move to safety. But again, for the salary the Jets were going to be paying him, at the minimum, he's guaranteed $6 million from the Jets. So you figured he would want at least $6 million if he was going to redo his deal. He wasn't going to take less than that because he's going to get $6 million no matter where he goes. That's still high for a player converting his position and changing his position to safety for the first time in his career. So he's going to be a first time safety making $6 million. That's just a little too high. So, you know, is it tough to see him walk away if you're a Jets fan? Yeah, sure. Is it, is it going to be tough to, to know that Revis has probably played his final game in a Jets jersey? Sure. If you're a Jets fan, that, that's undoubtedly something that's probably going through your mind. But at the end of the day, football is a business, and the business side of things and the football side of things just don't add up to keep Darrell Rivas here with the New York Jets in 2017. For NJ Advanced Media, I am Connor Hughes.